Hi, I'm Allison at Lazy Meter Fromage, and I'm gonna to put together a little BC cheese platter today. I have chosen a Grey Monk Pinot Gris to pair with our cheeses, because they're a little bit stronger, and it's off-dry character, I think will work really well with them. First cheese I've picked is uh, Romelia, which is a wash-drying goat cheese from Salt Spring Island. It has lots of character, nice little earthy flavor, and I think it'll work really well with the wine. Second cheese I've chosen is the Smits Medium Gouda. Smits are a really nice Dutch family. They're out in Chilliwack. And I'm just going to cut a little bit of this cheese up just so it's a bit easier for people to start. And um, this one says medium. They only age it for about six months, but it's really got a lot of full flavor. I've chosen to put some uh, rose petal jelly, and that's from Artisan Edibles over in, on Vancouver Island. And we're going to put some dried fruit with it and some nice, really simple crackers. I think you don't really want to detract too much from the cheese and from the wine. So I'll just put really something simple to go with it. I've chosen to do just two cheeses for this platter because I think it keeps it simple, keep the flavors nice and clean, and you can really enjoy your glass of wine that way. If you're interested in any of the things we've talked about today, you can see the links in the post below. Treat yourself to a nice cheese plate next time you have a great bottle of wine.